Dear Diary, it is Tuesday, November 13th. Oh, time is flying by way too quickly. And, um, I don't know, it's very cold. My bathrobe became my robe. Um, yeah, it's, uh, time flying by. I just want to get a quick entry in. Probably won't be a quick one <laughs> since I haven't, um, recorded in so long. I c couldn't believe it. Um, well, yesterday was Veterans Day. The kids, um... We're over. It was fun hanging out with them. They haven't been over in a little bit. And um, their girls were definitely surprised. And um, it was so cute. I think in protest, teeny... Cause, oh, I also brought out these... Um, kind of like, you know, those furry, almost like Ugg boots type of things. Um, but they have fur kind of like it folded over her fur. I should have brought it um, <clears throat> on the outside and teeny loves or hates the fur on like animal uh, stuff animals and stuff like that. So in protest last night, she brought them upstairs for me. <laughs> it was cute. Anyway, uh, teeny and mittens, of course, they're getting along. They're getting cuter. Uh, again, um, I was just showing hubby. Oh, there she is. Trying to bring me, she, she loves to play fetch too. If you throw her a ball, if you throw a ball of paper, throw it, she'll bring it to you. Anyway, so she is kind of getting along with Tuxi. Come here. Oh, thank you. See, she brought me paper. Want it? Want it? Go get it. She's such a dog. So cute. Um, but yeah, okay, enough about my cats. Um, she keeps bringing it to me. Anyway, um, what else? So I've been really busy trying to sell, uh, pins for my friends. My eBay has not been sold. Uh, list my eBay listings. It's just kind of a sucky time, I guess, for eBay. Everybody is so active on Facebook. There's, you can sell within your own groups. You can sell, like, Marketplace and all that. So I guess, really, eBay is kind of a, takes a backseat. Um, it's just so easy to sell things on, on, on a Facebook group. So, um, uh, I've always really liked pins, but never really, uh, actively collected much um but I did Wally because I really love Wally and I start I here and there I collect a little bit of Jeannie and um Mary Poppins but because now I'm selling for my friend I'm more active in that community and learning more and seeing more um now I'm buying a lot more, so that's why Jer calls me Peggy Bundy, <laughs> because I uh, basically am my own best customer. <laughs> um, but uh, I think we all sometimes need a little bit of treat or whatever you want to call it, to make ourselves a little bit happier and, 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 and um, just, you know, to make ourselves happy and do what we can to survive. Um, because in this world, there's just so much crap. Like, recently, <clears throat> now it's a fire. Um, I just can't believe this morning I read it took 41 lives. Um, there's just fire everywhere. Anyway, I, I don't want to, to make this a, kind of a, I don't want to make it a sad entry. So, just keep being on the positive. Um, so besides the pins <clears throat> that I'm actively, um, collecting, um, the, the diet, the keto diet, I'm still sticking to it, um, I found yesterday, um, I found online they sell these zero carbs bread. So 
um, I got some, so hopefully when we get it, we'll enjoy it. Um, because sometimes, here you go. I don't know if you can see her. There she is. See, she probably, hey, want it, want it, go. <laughs> Too cute. Um, but there she is again. Stealing the show, like always. Um, so, there she goes. <laughs> um, hi, Mittens. Uh, I really need to exercise, but now it's getting colder. I don't know. I know I'm making excuses. So, I just need to go and exercise and do it. Um, <laughs> so, nothing changed. We're sticking to not eating carbs and things like that, but just, uh, the exercise part, I think, and Jerry thinks I'm not eating enough carbs. She's like, you need to just eat one avocado meal. I'm like, okay. Um, so yeah. Oh, I did tell my doctor I would like to move forward with, with the continuous glucose monitoring. Um, cause right now I use you know, to test and then I do my own shots. So my doctor recommended it might be very helpful for me to um, do the G a CGM and also do a tandem pump. So I did some research. I was supposed to meet with a physician's assistant, but she's all booked up even lot. So it was like two weeks ago, mid October. I tried to book, and that physician assistant is not available until uh, second week of December. So the doctor just said, "Just do your own research, and if you want it, just let me know." And then, because once I order it, uh, I guess the company will arrange a meeting for me, anyways, to teach me everything. So, to my own research, I watched. YouTube videos, people who use it, how do I change the cartridge and all that. Um, of course, at first I was like, it looks complicated. Like, maybe I'll just stick to what I know for now. But I have to look past the initial complexity of it because, like everything, once you get used to it, um, it should become easier. And the main focus is, the main point is, once you wear this thing uh the cgm uh it i believe it said it tests your blood every five minutes and it helps you stick within your range so um it should really help you uh you know help you stay in your range because whenever you go up or down um i'm sure if you go up it just it just quickly gives you a little bit more insulin if you drop too little, it will, um, I saw it will alarm you. Like there's like beeping, I believe. And then it will like tell you to go eat or something. So that's definitely useful. And that's why they say wear with the tandem pump. Um, that way it does give you the insulin, not just alerts you. Cause a lot of it, it's just, if you don't wear the tan tandem pump with it, then, um, you will have to, no and go give yourself the insulin so that's why she suggested the um the tandem pump and another thing i had to wait till november because the, my husband's insurance uh changed they said it was getting better because the company purchased a better plan which turns out it is because at first you know you don't know you just been tell th told things like this is the way it is it's better you're supposed to believe it so at first we're all like, mm, is it really, um, yeah, so it is, um, so we'll see. I wrote my doctor a message last Friday. I know she doesn't work Friday and yesterday was Veterans Day. I'm guessing they don't work. So today, um, she should get the message and let me know what I need to do next or wait or whatever. So that's definitely something a little bit exciting and uh, I would say kind of scary at the moment um, uh, new things always kind of I don't want to say scary but it just you know I, I'm the worry word I'm the type kind of gets 
a little put off by new things. I don't like change. So we'll see. Um, but I do believe this is the positive change. Thank you. I do believe this is the positive change for me. Um, well, today my period just came. So there it goes. Month. Eight. I already forgot. Um, in a way, I think it's good. <clears throat> Hi. Did you bring it? Yes, she did. Look. Go get it. So, I, I think we're really just going to, come here. Thank you. Oh. Um, just kind of take it day by day, month by month. You know, I've seen so many stories where people have tried two years, three years, five years. So, um, I do believe in the whole, when your body is ready, it will be ready. So, um, I'm just not going to stress out too much about it. But, uh, at the same time, you know, do pay attention and help myself get ready. So, anyway, this is, became a long one. So, Jiggles Mail signing off for now.